So you actually want to learn a language. Well, congratulations. Welcome to the grind. Your level one, level 60 is far off and between you and level 60 is about 600,000 probably boards that you need to slay. Now you're probably thinking, what's with all these gaming references? Well, for one, I am a gamer and two, I work in the games industry, which is why you can trust what I'm about to say in the next 30 seconds is true because I'm not trying to sell you courses. I don't work within the polyglot, giga polyglot community, whatever you want to call it. I simply learn languages for fun. In fact, I rarely make videos on this channel. So this is how you learn a language. You grind. That's pretty much it. You sit there, you repeat hundreds of sentences a day, thousands of sentences a month, 200,000 plus sentences a year, and you do that for one or two years, and guess what? You will be really, really good at your language, and everyone will be kneeling down and worshipping at your feet as you pick up that legendary level 60 sword and you show everyone how freaking awesome you are. But unfortunately, you do have to grind. You can't just hop there. You gotta slowly walk down that path and do that grinding. So how do you do that grinding? Well, guess what? I've got a simple course I can sell you, no joking. You get a sentence with some audio, Probably not the best sentence, it's saying uh, in the colony lots of people were slaughtered <laughs> and you repeat the sentence and you do that hundreds of times a day which will take you probably one to two hours depending on how much you repeat each sentence. I like to do three times. Then you do that every day, which obviously is then gonna clock up a lot of repetitions. And then you do that every month and you do it every year and you eventually lose your sanity. That's how you learn a language. You don't need fancy courses. You're not going to learn this in a week in a day, in three months, maybe in a year, depending on the language, you could possibly pull it off, a simple language that's close to your own or a designed language like Esperanto, totally possible. But apart from that, it's really that simple. So forget all these language learning videos out there. In fact, you can pretty much end this video right here because I'm just gonna jabber on for the next few minutes about how most of it's just bullshit. In fact, I'm gonna be very curious about the YouTube analytics, is at this point when everyone drops off, you don't need to do anything fancy. It's simply a grind. Now you might be thinking, but evil dear, I want to do something fancy. I don't want to grind. Well, I'm sorry to tell you, all that fancy shit out there it ain't gonna help. What about comprehensible input? I heard if I just sat down and watched a lot of videos over and over and over and over, I will learn. Well, guess what you're doing with this? This is comprehensible input. It's just designed in order to give you the words that you want to learn at a frequency enough for you to actually absorb it. The problem with just sitting down and watching videos over and over and over is for the first thousand words, you're probably going to get like a lot of repetition. So you probably will learn those words in context. But then for the next 2000, you get a massive diminishing return. And then the next 2000, guess Guess what? You're probably barely ever going to hear those words and therefore you're not going to really absorb them. You're going to put in more and more and more substantial time. In fact, if you want to learn specific words like the ones that I've got in this sentence here, Jermindi, which is colony, and Tansha, which is the slaughter or massacre, well, unless you're going to watch a lot of news reports over and over about the Ukraine-Russia war, you're not going to pick up those words in context. But I have, I think, 10 or 15 sentences that use both of those words independently in this deck. This deck has a couple of, no, actually, it's got four or five thousand sentences I've created in it. And I just repeat them over and over. And my Chinese level has shot up massively. I stumbled with Chinese for years, but now I can actually have conversations in the language. Surprise, surprise. And that's after three months of basically doing this. So why didn't I do this before? Well, I did for Esperanto, but then I got good at Esperanto and I was like, well, I'm going to learn another language, but this time I'm going to be more efficient and smarter about it. I'm going to go find out what the polyglots do. And then they sold me a bunch of courses. And guess what? I fell for it. I lapped that stuff up. Okay, I'm going to go do this. I'm going to go do that. And at the end of the day, I just came back to the same method. It's just grinding, baby. There's nothing else to it. Okay, well, that's pretty much it. I continued on for a good three minutes beyond the actual one minute you need. Don't go watch language learning videos. They're completely pointless. Go watch people who speak the language, maybe. Like, you know, it's like inspiration. But you don't need language learning videos. You literally just got to repeat hundreds of sentences. Now, maybe you don't like that. Well, sucks to be you.